So for this, we have three bears. Okay, so top bear I'm going to do first. So for top bear, I have a box representing top bear. Whoops, that's way too big, hold on. Okay, so I'm just gonna draw a basic box to represent each of these bears. And I'm gonna do it kind of like a rectangle just so that it's easier to get two arrows in. Okay, so for top bear, top bear, Top bear weighs 350, or I'm sorry, 3,500 newtons, okay? So that means that FG for top bear equals negative, whoops, negative 3,500 newtons. So if we, then our normal force, since top bear is at rest, our normal force is going to be equal to the sum uh, the positive sum of the forces that are pointing down. So Fn is equal to 3,500 newtons, okay? All right, so as soon as we get to middle bear, we now have two forces that are pointing down. Oops. And when you wanna try to make this line about as long as this line, I mean, it's. It's a little bit tricky, I know. Middle bear weighs a little bit less, so I'm gonna make this a little bit smaller. You really just wanna make sure that within your one sketch, all of the arrows are relative to one another. Okay, so like this arrow needs to be much longer, for example. And grading, grading wise, this would be like a one point thing, okay? So it'd be like the difference between a three and a four, not the difference between a four and a two, okay? Okay, so for middle bear, oops, middle bear weighs 978 newtons. So that means that FG is equal to negative 978 newtons. Middle bear also is supporting top bear who weighs 3,500 newtons. So that means that middle bear has a push force equal to negative 3,500 newtons, okay? So if, if middle bear has a gravity force and a push force equal to those, then it's going to have a normal force equal to the sum of those, okay? So 35, whoops, so 3,500 plus 978, we end up getting a normal force equal to 4470. Yes, it is. Yes, yeah, so 4478. Okay, then finally, top bear. Top bear also has two forces going down. So the the push force for for top bear is also going to be a little bit longer than its gravity force. So I just want to make sure that I'm drawing my arrows in a way that shows that. And I also have a very, a much larger arrow for my normal force for them. Okay, so my, oops, start with gravity. So bottom bear weighs 4,500. So FG is equal to negative 4,500. Bottom bear is supporting middle bear and middle bear has a normal force of 4478. So that means that bottom bear has a push force equal to negative 4478. And then we have, whoops, if we add those two numbers together, we get a norm, whoops, a normal force for bottom bear that is equal to 8978 newtons.